All right, what's up, guys? Day's a good day, a bad day. Slept through my college class. Just woke up like 20 minutes ago, as you can see. But I got one second. Five packages came, and I need to open them. So I'm going to open them right now. This is really hard to do with one hand. I heard some dumb things and I heard some cool things. First thing in this package is my front license plate delete, which I think looks really sick. And it's just like a plastic acrylic that's gonna go on my front license plate. I know, yeah, it came with high rail. Sweet. So, comes with hardware. I'm gonna put that in today. And then we're gonna see what are in all of these. I'm gonna open this. And my freaking toe. Oh, this is just a sticker. I ordered an Instagram mat sticker just for the fun of it because they were like two bucks. And I ordered them. Um... Oh, this is my front memo. I ordered this. It was pretty cheap, and I just figured it would probably look cool. I'm going to have to put more double-sided tape on there, but it should look pretty sick on the front. There's two things for the front of the car. All that's in there. I'm going to open this one now. This one. Just a sticker. Bought a Mishimoto sticker. Nothing really big, but... I thought that was pretty cool, so I bought that. Next, we're gonna open this. I think this is um my lug nuts or my Velstone covers. I'm guessing it's lug nuts, but I'm gonna check real quick. And here, this is my shift knob I ordered that I did not think would come so soon, but it did. That's pretty sick. It was pretty cheap. It was 39 bucks, but it looked cool, and it had metal inserts, which was cooler. Yeah, that's pretty sick. Those flowers actually look really cool. And it should have more, yeah, more metal inserts in there, so. This is actually really sick. And it doesn't feel shitty. It feels nice. It's big. It's clear. It's really clear. So that's sweet. That's really sweet, actually. Get that out of there. One-handed. More inserts, and yeah, they are metal. So these should last a lot longer than... Those plastic inserts you get from other shift knobs. And then there's that. And then the last package, which is right here, which I think is my Instagram ad sticker, so I'm going to check into this real quick. Just opened it. Reaching down in the hole. Squeegee, big squeegee. Instructions. How to apply a vinyl decal. And then my big Instagram at sticker. Man, if any of you guys want to follow me, there it is. But that's going to go on my car. So, for today, I ordered the two, three days ago, which is pretty good. So I got these two stickers. Front license plate delete. Uh, shift knob. That front emblem. And the hardware for that. So, that's pretty sick. I have five more stuff coming, and I will not tell you guys until they come because I don't know. I just think that'd be cooler of a video. So this would be like part one, of just putting on like a big Amazon, like eBay part thing because I figured it'd be funny to make like a budget, budget stuff for the my car. So I'm gonna have this video come out tonight, and then I'll probably post another one later this week. So. That's it for today. I'm going to go put these on my car. I'll probably video all of it, but that's just it for the unboxing today. So I'll see you when I go outside. Okay, so we're in my car right now, obviously. This is my old shift knob, and I do like it, but it's it was like a $5 shift knob. And it's really shitty because, look, they have the plastic inserts. 
So it's got a big ass thread right there. And then this insert, which I'm not gonna be able to get off. So I brought pliers. I actually wanna see if this is the right size. Is this the right size? It's sick. Yeah, that's the right size. So they got the right size already in there. So I just need to get this off and then I'm gonna screw it down. So I get back right. Oh, God dang. I get right back to you as soon as I can get this off because I don't think I can do this one handed. Wait, I'll actually try it real quick, but I'm not gonna make you wait because this is gonna take forever. Pulling it off, clean this off. <laughs> Those threads are clean. And I'm pretty sure this is the right size, so I'm just gonna thread this one on. It's obviously pretty simple of a step for anyone that's trying to put a new shifter in. Not a new shifter, but a shift knob. She is, it's tight all the way. So yeah, it's definitely bigger than I thought, and the shift retainer doesn't come up all the way. I just made it because, so I mean, it's kind of wiggly. I have to put some electrical tape in there, but makes it a really long throw. But it's cool, I like it. Move on to, I'm gonna do the front plate delete next so we'll do that right now okay this is sick because it comes with the inserts you need so I'm gonna pop these in there I think that's all you need to do honestly I don't know if these are gonna be big enough because they kind of fit in there really like not too well but I'll see I'll put them in right now just to see how they'll fit It's gonna look like that when it's done, but I need to get these in, so one second. I put this in, and I don't know if it's just, I think I need to put something behind it because it's not staying tight. The things are just coming out of it. As you can see, I'm gonna have to wrap uh, something around them to make them really snug so it fits in there, but for right now, for just seeing what it looks like, it stays up. It's not gonna stay up, but that's what it looks like right now. It's kind of small, but I mean, it doesn't look bad, so. I'm just gonna keep this off for now. Just because you can see, these are just not snug enough. And I don't know if they're supposed to fit in behind this, because I don't know, oh, sorry. I don't know how I could fit something in there behind it. So I'm just gonna find some electrical tape, make them bigger, and then I'll put those on. It's sticker, but this fits perfect. I need more double side tape because there's not enough on this I need a yeah, heat gun to get the actual emblem off so I'm not going to do this today and I will do this later today when I have time but I have to help my dad real quick but I will fix that put that on and put both these stickers on today and then that'll be it for the video but this will not be going on today this will be going on another day I'll probably make its own video about this because it's going to take a little bit to get that off that emblem off with the heat gun so Next, we're going to put this on. I don't know where I'm going to put it, but I'm going to find a way, so I'm going to do it. I'm just going to put this Mishy Moto one right here. I need to put the camera down to do it, so it's going to be right there once I pick up the camera again. Put it right here. I don't get any bubbles.
lot of you guys probably won't like it. But if it's not, I don't want to cluster the back with these long stickers. So I figured right here is good. I mean, it is straight. So my my one is really weirdly curved, but I don't think it looks bad, honestly. And the color of the Instagram sticker really pops it, which kind of makes it look kind of bad, but because it's colored Instagram logo, but I think it looks pretty good, honestly. I don't think it looks bad. trying to overly sticker bond this thing i'm just trying to make it look good with black and white stickers so I figured it would look good so now i'm just going to fix up things that need electrical tape so i don't need my car on anymore because it's warm and all my stickers are good so let me close this still can't put this on so this is going to go in retirement for now these are all done that's all done that's all done that's all done putting electrical tape around the bottom base of this so this boot stays up and retained and on the ends of these so it'll fit in the front license plate things snugly I just wrapped this a few times in electrical tape let's see if that's snug enough but I do not know yet oh not quite so we're gonna keep going but it's getting a lot better okay let's finish this up just that Put some tape down there. It doesn't go all the way up, I know, but it's retained now, so that's good. Now we just have this to do. <coughs> okay, I got <coughs> excuse me, this on. All I do is wrap a couple layers of tape around the little nubs that went into the front license plate mount, and boom, all set. So this is my final product of the car, other than the front badge. And the other stuff will work for the uh, exterior of it. To rice it out some more so i know that's pretty eye-catching it's pretty big and colorful shift knob <clears throat> mission motor sticker and that's it so i hope you guys enjoyed this little unboxing video of some cheap parts i put on my car um and i'm going to have another one of these videos probably next week so i'll get right back with you guys on all that stuff when that comes so thank you guys for watching and i'll get Thank you guys for watching and I'll catch you guys later.